Hey everyone, it's Jason, your business video pro here in Tucson, Arizona. And today we are continuing our adventure along the Turquoise Trail. If you like what you hear, please support this local channel by liking, subscribing, and of course, enjoying more of our content. Feel free to reach out to me if you'd like help producing videos that highlight your business here in Tucson. Let me take you back in time to 1929 when a real gem of Tucson's history was born. The Pima County Historic Courthouse, an absolute beauty built in the Spanish colonial revival style. Designed by architect Roy Place, it served Pima County for a whopping 86 years, playing host to countless weddings and housing various county departments. By 1978, it officially earned its spot on the National Register of Historic Places and was crowned the most outstanding Spanish colonial revival building in Arizona. Now, if you stroll through the courtyard, you might notice a granite strip along the red tile walkway. That's not just for show. It marks the original east wall of the Presidio, giving us a little peek into the past. Pretty cool, right? The dome? Yeah, it's kind of a big deal. It's even featured on the official Pima County logo. Make sure you're taking a look at the other videos on this channel about things to do and see and eat all around here and what you need to know about visiting and living in Tucson, Arizona. Please like and subscribe for future Tucson content. For over 150 years, this spot has been the home of Tucson's Pima County Courthouse, and the current building is actually the third iteration. Built in 1929, this courthouse finally hung up its robe in 2015, but it wasn't the end of the story. Today, it's a bustling hub housing the Southern Arizona Heritage and Visitor Center, the University of Arizona's Gem and Mineral Museum, and more. Now this place has seen its fair share of action. Ever heard of John Dillinger? Yes, the infamous bank robber was captured in Tucson back in 1934 after a fire at the Hotel Congress. An awesome facility that is still in operation and one that we'll see later on our tour of the Turquoise Trail. Dillinger was held right here at the Pima County Jail. The courtroom was packed, as you'd imagine, and here's a fun twist. Johnny Depp, who played Dillinger in the movie Public Enemies, also pled guilty to speeding in the same courtroom years later. Talk about a full circle moment. So whether you're a history buff, a fan of classic architecture, or just someone who loves a good story, the Pima County Historic Courthouse is a must see. I hope you've learned a little bit about the Pima County Historic Courthouse. To learn more about this and the Turquoise Trail and the points of interest along the way, or any others in the Tucson area, I would love to assist. All my contact information is in the description below this video and on our channel. I specialize in using video as a medium to help local businesses communicate their brand in order to educate and attract more clients. So if you want top quality video for your website, YouTube, and social media, make sure you call me up to set up a complimentary consultation. Comment below with your favorite thing you learned about the courthouse. And please check out all the other videos on this channel to see more examples of how we've helped local businesses with video and to see more fun videos featuring Tucson. Thank you so much for watching this today. I will see you in the next video or when we are creating one together.